Oh, hi, Randolph. I didn't see you there. Oh, so I you. noticed you're at this Xbox 360 showcase at E3, and you just played some Gears of War, yeah. right? Th that's why I was actually looking at wistfully over my shoulder, because I just played uh, a multiplayer mode in it called Overrun. It made me think about the, the previous multiplayer modes in, in Gears of War. So we should actually mention, this is the newly announced Gears yes. of War. It's not DLC for Gears of War 3, right? Yeah, Which is, is only came out like a few days ago, yeah. by my math. So this is Gears of War Judgment. Does that sound about right to you? And, you know, the main protagonists in this are, you know, the Cold Train and Baird. Um, and this, this, this new mode is called Overrun. It's a little bit beast mode, a little bit horde mode. So it's, it's a competitive mode uh, where you have a uh, cog side and a locust side. Five aside, and it's a timed objective thing. Um, and essentially, on the cog side, you have um, set classes. You have four different classes: so engineer, scout. And on the locus side, uh, it's a bit more interesting. You actually have a tiered system there. So the first tier is essentially is your, I guess, bottom rung locus. So you have those little, what do you call those little running things that just like run up to you and explode? A ticker. Oh, okay. Or it could be a retcher or a grenadier or a cantor. So like th those guys are sort of. <laughs> Cantos, I believe. So those guys basically are like healers, and the Grenadiers are, I'm just gonna keep going through these. <laughs> the Grenadiers essentially are your basic sort of like grunt class. And the interesting thing with the Locust side is you can actually use the currency that you get playing within the game to unlock even more badass Locust guys. So uh, you can get, you know, like much, much bigger beasts to try and destroy uh, the main objective in, in Overrun. And, and the cool thing about it is, you know, the demo that they were showing us was locked to six minutes. So the longer it seems that the game goes, the more it favors the Locust side because you can sort of build up and, you know, get to the tier two and just absolutely annihilate the, uh, the cog side. I've been told that, you know, once the game fully does come out, uh, you can set those different times. So if you want to go shorter, if you want to go longer, and you want to try and be a bit more badass cog, then you can do that. So how did it feel? You, got, you went hands-on with the controller. Did it feel like... You know, more Gears of War, or does it feel like it's sort of a fresh direction? Well, you know, it, it did feel, you know, just like Gears of War, obviously. So, you know, they, they've, you know, kind of refined the gameplay now to, you know, to a very good point. So, I guess the most interesting about it was, you know, yeah, you, you do, you know, once again, you get to play Locus, and, you know, it's a competitive mode. So, I guess that's a cool new thing.